Smile. Okay, today's May 27th, Memorial Day Sunday. We're working overtime. Here's our friend Oscar. Haircut, different dog. Looks like a poodle now. I don't know. All right. Obviously, he's taught to stay in his crate. Camille will release him. Okay. By saying okay. Good. He comes Good out. Boy. The only time, and then she plays. At, he can't jump. She raised her leg. He's just very excited. We just took him out. Uh, get down low and praise him, hon. Oscar. You, so that's what triggers. He can't get his four feet, have to stay in the ground. Okay, so here we are again. We're going to do the place command. Oscar's on his leash. Camille's going to drop it. She's going to tell him to go place and start walking towards Oscar. the crate. Go place. Go place. Good. And he goes in there voluntarily for a treat. The only time he gets a morsel of food is in his crate, and the only time he can come out of come out oh is when she releases him. Go ahead and release okay. him. He can pet, pet food, go, only food in the crate. And he doesn't get lured in with food. He gets told to go in. Good boy, ask good boy. All right, we're going to go up to the train station. Okay, normally when we finish up our training, we end up at the train station because the train station offers a lot of distractions, noises, just something as simple as a flagpole, a train. These are all distractions. So we teach the dog to relax. And when Camille's ready, she's going to release him, and we're going to go for a walk. He might be a little nervous about jumping, so she puts a little pressure. Not okay, pull, 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 pull. Good. There's a steady pressure. Good. 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 Notice no tension on the leash. Camille's going to ask him to heal, Oscar, and off he goes. Good. A little correction just to remind him that he has to be obedient. Go around that plant. Left. Sorry. Go ahead. Where am I going? Just towards me. Then she slows down. He sits automatically. Notice her hands didn't move. She's going to step out with her left without saying anything. Go tight left. Tight left. Slow down, come to a stop. She corrects slightly, to right foot. She stepped out with her right, he stayed. Go back to his side and praise. Good, left foot forward, heel. Good. And then just go there and give him free time and I'll tell you, so I was gonna cut. Good. And that, free time, good. Okay, we're here again at the train station. The dog is on his free time, meaning he can, if he wanted to, he could pee, he could poop, he could sniff. Camille's is always relaxed as ever, calm, cool, and collective. Look at her, she could be a secret agent. <laughs> Left foot forward, tell him to heal, That's ask him. Here. The dog goes voluntarily, head towards the dry cleaner, little fast pace. Good, good, about turn. Left turn, so Camille can go fast. The dog will go fast. Normal. Good, beautiful. Slow down, come to a stop. Good, the dog sits automatically. And what we have to understand here or recognize, there's a lot happening here. It may not look like it to the, to the humans, but for the dog, there's all kinds of things happening. She's gonna step out with her left and say heel. You watch, make a right. Good. Make a left. Good. So we have a lot of activity here. We're going to try to negotiate through here. Go ahead. Nice, confident pace. Now it's dark. It's echoey. You see how confident he is. And we're almost finished up here. We got all our commands. Camille's going to go up that ramp. Good. Helps him out a little with a correction. Nice and confident. This is like a, she, the dog's getting a little nervous because he's getting, <laughs> he's getting a high up. So he's a little nervous up on the platform. And then she's going to stop at the top of the stairs, ask, 
He's nervous for the height, so just, yeah, there you go. Yeah, help him a little. So here's the place we do some work because you can see he's nervous just by being elevated. We're gonna wait a minute and you'll see his confidence develop. So this is something we didn't know. Left foot forward, heel. Good, 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 good. Make a right. Then left about turn. So you see, as soon as he got down to this level, he was fine, slow down, come to a stop. The dog sits perfectly. Step out with your right. Good. Good. Go to his side and praise him. Left foot forward heel. Go fast. Normal. Left about turn. Slow down, come to a stop. Just wait. Left foot forward heel. Good. Left about turn. Good. Good. Look, right turn. Left about turn. Slow down, come to a stop. Good. Uh, step out with your right. A lot happening. This is where this stuff has to be reinforced. C-O-M-E. Good. Yep. Good, go ahead. Go up those stairs if you can, and watch him shut down when he gets up. Watch. That's all right, hon. Good. Go, go down. That's good. Now he's much better this time than the first time. Left foot forward, heel. Good. Much better. So it's just a matter of make a right. Just a matter of getting him accustomed to the kick on the train. come to a stop correct and you got to understand here's the train this is wonderful left foot forward heel good really nice and just end up in the shade good stay just try the DOW out down Go ahead. Good. 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 Come to his side, praise him a little, and keep him there. Step on it, left foot. Good. Good. That's good, honey. You're really showing off your confidence today, aren't you? You're feeling good. All right, though. He is. Go ahead, left foot forward, heel. About turn. Good. Now, slow down, come to a stop. Good, stay. Go back to his side and praise him. Left foot forward, heel, go by the birdies. A lot of birds, little correction. Slow down, come to a stop. All right, let's go take 